Welcome back again to my YouTube channel. Uh, today we're going to learn some amazing procedures that are done in cardiac and uh, I hope you are going to enjoy the lessons that we are going to go through together. Thank you. Hello viewers, my name is Geoffrey Abwao and uh, today we are going to learn about cryoablation or maze procedure and um, I uh, want to know about the indication and the indication is about uh, is atrial fibrillation and um, atrial fibrillation is uh, normally occurs when there is this interruption of normal uh, movement of uh, um, uh, impulses uh, in the atria and uh, this one uh, leads to deprivation 30% deprivation of uh, cardiac output and this can be corrected uh, by uh, uh, when they are doing uh, mitral valve replacement and this uh, is achieved by application of uh, uh, a probe uh, using uh, nitrous oxide and it is done with uh, for 120 seconds I'm going to show you a diagram where this uh, cryo uh, surgery or cryo ablation is placed or is done so the left atrial uh, cryoablation performed from the opening of the right at, uh, upper pulmonary vein to the midpoint of the left upper pulmonary vein opening by left atrial top from the opening of the right lower pulmonary vein to the midpoint of left pulmonary vein opening from the opening of the right lower pulmonary vein to the left atrial and from the right pulmonary vein opening to the mitral annulus every line is cryoablated for 120 seconds as illustrated in that diagram thank you so uh, our viewers with me here is my colleague Hesborn, and uh, he's going to take us through the cryoablation machine how it works and the functions and um, different parts of, and connection welcome Hesborn. okay thank you very much my name is Hesborn, as you have heard and i'm going to take you through the cryoablation machine and I'm going to take you through how to set up, how to operate, uh, how to change probes, how to exchange uh, probes, how to replace uh, cylinders, and how to set up the machine. So first of all, uh, as this is our cryo machine, cryo surgery system machine. And uh, how to connect it, we have the cryo, cryo machine, we have the cylinder behind me, and also we have another cylinder. Uh, the cylinder which we usually use is medical gradient nitrous oxide only. That's the the cylinder which we use for this machine. So again, I'll show you how to turn to shut down the system. So we turn off this uh, the cylinder, and uh, this on and off knob we turn it on and off repeatedly until the pressure gauge reads zero. We turn off the system on and off to the off side then we turn off the main meter okay sorry we, we remove first the probes after removing the probes we turn or uh, we we turn main meter off and that's when you uh, you'll be fully shut down again uh, this is our I, I have to show you this probe this is our probe the cryo probe And this is the one that's, that goes to the field. Uh, so you, you have to keep it sterile uh, to halfway. So you can use, uh, depending with the, where you are, you can use uh, Spirit or Sidex to sterilize uh, this front part so that uh, because it goes to the sterile field. So this is our machine. And uh, this is uh, the machine that we use to turn to bend uh, the tip of this uh, this machine. So this is how we bend the tip. This is how we bend the tip and uh, the surgeon can use it uh, where, where he wants to use it. So thank you very much. I hope you enjoyed the video. Thank you very much.